Today I'm gonna unbox one of my seats because I got both of them, but I don't want to drag them in here. You guys hit them on Sunday, so. I'm gonna unbox one of my seats, I'm gonna unbox the rear diffuser, and I'm gonna unbox this harness bar. And, and then I'll, I'm not gonna install it today because I don't really have time, but I'm sorry. I'm gonna take out the other seats, start cleaning the carpet, get the process started to get them ready to go in the car. So let's do this rear bumper diffuser. Package is pretty good. It's like hard plastic and two layers. And then it has some foam board. It's in a, it's actually in a package. Like I thought it was someone made it from home, but it's actually in a real package. I got this on eBay. Shipped and everything was 38 bucks. I think 38, 24, something like that. I don't have all the exact prices right now, but when I do go over the list of all the stuff I bought, I show the receipts, I will show you guys. I'm going to share everything cost. Got some foam stuff around it. Keep it protected. The black one. Like this. And just, all I got to do is get a hole saw bit. I don't have a big one. Drill that circle and I can just grind out the edges to the sides. Drill that and draw the holes. Put it on. I don't know. I thought it came with hardware. I guess it doesn't. I don't see any hardware. I was just showing the picture. I thought it was hardware. I got to get my own hardware. But yeah, this is it. I'm not gonna open it out this plastic because I'm not installing it right now, so I want to keep protected. And yep. Yeah. Here's a couple of fusions. And over there, or right, it's the harness bar. Give me that scissors. Alright, the harness bar, this was out, I it was like it said 98, but it was shipped and everything it was like 102 bucks. I think there's a hole over here. I'm probably just gonna try and rip out oh, this tape and all. Oh, oh like trying to rip all this tape off right now. See like that, we'll just pull it out. Oh man. It's heavy. Anything else in there? This one comes with. I got blue because I'm trying to go with blue. I got red seats, but I'm going with the blue and red theme for the interior. I am going to, right now, when I do the, the hardware is right here. I don't want to have both because I don't want to lose it. It's all right here. It has the blue harness bar, which you can see. When I fully take it out, I'll show it to you. And then it has the hardware right here, all the bolts. Then it has two rails. They connect to the harness bar and go to the bottom of the car by where the seat bolts for more support. It's cool. See it right there. To the seat. I'm going to have space in here. So, see. It's looking light. Here's the rails right here. I bought the racket, on brackets rails, and then I bought should come up harnesses too. I don't know where those are in. Located at. Okay, yeah. Once again, I'm gonna keep it in the plastic because I want to install it here. I don't want to be dirty. Reclining, we'll put it down. I'll tie it. Let's see what we look at. I'm going to tie it back. Take a red tie for the car. Red stitching, holes to the harnesses. That's all that comes in the box. Using the rail. Just the rails and the bolts. I'm not gonna take that out because I'm not dealing with that right now. Yeah, that's it. Nice seat, it's comfortable. It's so good. I'll do a VR once I install them and actually drive on them, but 
you look real nice. Feel good. That's it.